Hey everyone, welcome to the Rapture Report. So, you may have heard the news, an Outlast movie is in the works and it's being produced by the same studio that brought us the Saw franchise. For many, Outlast was not just a game, it was an experience. It was one of the first first person horror titles that I recall seeing go mainstream with streamers. You know, the types who play through these jump scare fest games and react in an over the top manner all for people's amusement. I'm not saying that Outlast was the first game to do this, just the first one I remember really taking off. So many games that came after Outlast attempted to replicate the fear it generated. Also, it popularised the mechanic of being hunted by an antagonist in which all you can really do is hide to survive. Outlast is a renowned survival horror game that has captivated players with its intense gameplay and terrifying atmosphere. Developed by Red Barrels, the game involves navigating a dilapidated psychiatric hospital overrun by homicidal patients. Then came Outlast 2. I was thrilled to dive into the new narrative exploring the terrifying village and the relentless pursuit of the cult. In Outlast, you can't fight back the enemies. Instead, you must navigate the environment and hide to survive. The gameplay mechanic creates a high level of tension and fear. Outlast has left a significant mark on the horror gaming landscape. Its approach to survival horror, focusing on evasion rather than combat, has influenced many other games in the genre. Having played both Outlast games, I personally found them to be immersive and nerve-wracking experiences. The games excel in building a haunting narrative that keeps players on the edge of their seats, wondering what horror lies around the corner. The announcement of an Outlast movie adaption comes with high expectations. The film is set to be produced by the same studio that brought us the Saw series, known for its psychological twists and gory scenes. This collaboration promises to deliver a film that stays true to the game's horrifying and suspenseful atmosphere. Prolific horror film producer Roy Lee, who has worked on horror movies such as It, Barbarian, Late Night with the Devil and Strange Darling, will lead the adaption. Lee will bring the film the same terrifying authenticity that has made the critically acclaimed psychological horror game franchise a fan favourite for over 37 million players worldwide. J.T. Petty, who is deeply involved in the story for the games themselves, will be working on the film's screenplay. Petty previews the movie by saying, Red Barrels has been pushing the limits of horror in games for more than a decade, and expanding the Outlast universe into film is an incredible opportunity to dive deeper into the characters and killers we love. So, how do you feel about a film based on Outlast? What are your memories of playing the games? Let me know in the comments below, I'll see you on the next edition of the Rapture Report.